Oh, hi, hi, that's me just testing the water temperature before I go for my swim. And it is irrelevant, because this is Scotland. The water's probably not going to be that warm. But a lot of people do ask me, what's the temperature like in the places you go swimming? I say, I don't know. I never measure it. I've got my own temperature chart. Here's how it works. Top of the chart is roasting. So on a beautiful summer day, you get this maybe a couple times a year in Scotland, when the sun's been on a loch, been on the sea all day. It's like being in a bath. You could be in there for hours. It is beautiful. That's roasting. Next up is decent. Decent happens during summer, maybe the end of autumn. Again, nice summer's day. You see a good loch, the sun's been on it. You can get in there, you can swim without a wetsuit, a good 20 minutes. That's decent. Next on the list, it's no bad. So no bad's when you get in and you don't immediately want to get it straight back out. It's basically, if the water doesn't cause your feet pain. Oh, that's no bad like. And if it's not quite no bad, it's aye, all right. So aye, all right happens when you get in, you go for a swim, you paddle about a bit, maybe your mates are on the side and they're thinking about it and they say, what's it like? Aye, it's all right, aye. And they're like, aye, all right. Sometimes it's a wee bit chilly. So that's when you're getting in and it's pretty sore to get in without a wetsuit on. You duck your head under, you paddle a bit, you come up. It's when you've got that horrible cold head, the ice cream head, that is starting to get a bit brutal. Most of the time, it usually is cold. A cold is pretty self-explanatory. For me anyway, I get in the water and things, you know, start to get a wee bit smaller. And I'm talking obviously about my hands. They get really small and shrunken and shriveled in cold water. Only my hands though. Nothing else. Nothing else. And the worst of it is when it's Baltic. Baltic is basically when you're breaking the ice on the edge of the loch to get in. It's kind of an in, out, shake it all about, make sure nothing's falling off and everything's still intact on your body. It's brutal. You know, Baltic can also be referred to as fucking cold, hooda cold, and bollocks to this, I'm getting out now. So all that's left to do is test out the water temperature today and see what it ranks on my scale. Aye, it's alright. <coughs> Aye, it's alright. <laughs>